All right. We've got to try to beat Havel this time. I'm going to actually try to put on different armor. Jeez, okay, you two, come on. Man, I, I've got to not take hits. And I, well, I'm pretty terrible at not taking hits, apparently. Great. I don't think, see, I've thought about firebombing him, but I don't think firebombs would even do that much. Dude's got a cool list of everything resistance. Oh. I need this man's ring. No. I've got to just accept that I'll have to come back when I've got the uh, when I've got the souls to you when I've got the levels to use the black knight sword because I don't think I'm actually good enough to beat this guy without uh, without a bigger weapon. Well, in that case, then, we're going to go ahead for the, the um, uh oh, man, more hollow warrior armor. We're going to head to that bridge to try to kick the one thing down, the ladder down.
I gotta use a different shield. I don't have one. I'm more co concerned about the fire from the dragon because I'm pretty sure I'm just going to get nuked. I just made it. How should I acquire these souls? I mean, I don't regret buying the, the club, by the way. The club, the reinforced club, is a really solid weapon once you've got it upgraded. I think I see I think I need the 18 dexterity no matter what. I think the strength I could probably get away with like 16 for the Black Knight Zord. <sighs> Soul farming is boring as it gets. I would dupe if I could. Level up. Whoops, dexterity. Let's go try to do literally any damage with this. Oh man, no, I'm dead. I guess what we're doing from here on out for a minute at least is going to be soul farming so we can use the Black Knight Sword. Once we can do that, I think we can handle Havel relatively easily. Usually, usually I end up using the Gravelord Sword, so it's, you know, it's odd no matter what. <sighs> Actually, you know what? I might try using the longsword.
Okay, so it's fun, but it's not all that great. I'd love it if I could get um, the battle axe, the one the the hollows use. Oh, I just died down there. I knew I was rusty, but wow. So, I don't know if anyone else suffers from this one, but when I play other games, I get, you know, really out of it. And I play multiple games. You know, for example, this month we've got Call of Duty and Minecraft and such. And then we've got Dark Souls, which is so, like, I mean, they're all totally different. So, I get, like, out of it, and I'm... <sighs> Woo. I struggle with any one of them really after you know especially if I've played them all in the same day which I did like yesterday man that little frenzy Brutal. You glitch out of the wall over here somewhere, friend? Because that guy left a message, be wary of rolling. You saw that, right? That was as silly as it looked, wasn't it? There we go. What's the message here? Try jumping off, huh? I'm wondering if he's telling us something. Because, like, he doesn't mean here.
Hmm. Down there. I mean, the depths is right down there. So I'm wondering if... If that's what he's trying to tell me. But if I fall off that way, I die. So, hmm. There is absolutely a way to get off of this. I just got to figure out what it is. You cheeky boy. I feel like I can get down here somehow. Wait, hold on, Chief. What are you doing there? Yo, dude. That's an arm and a leg. No, oh, that's, that's a whole man. Huh. All right, well, I'm going to let, let go I'm going to go back and level up dexterity. Next episode we have to do more grinding.